So in this video, we're dealing with carbolic acid poisoning. Carbolic acid is also known as phenol. When it is pure, it is in the form of colorless needle-like crystals. It has a sweet burning taste and phenolic taste and smell. When left in air and exposed to light, it turns pink and liquefies. It is present in Dettol and Lysol like solutions. Now the signs and symptoms of carbolic acid poisoning are called carbolism. They are divided into mainly three types of symptoms. One is the local action, other is the alimentary tract or GIT tract and third are remote or systemic actions. Now locally, carbolic acid is very rapidly absorbed from all surfaces, even intact skin. And it causes necrosis and sloughing off of tissues because it has a remarkable penetrating property. GIT it causes burning pain, anesthesia, speech and swallowing is difficult. There is no vomiting due to the anesthetic action of carbolic acid. The lips and mouth are corroded and the burns are white, which then later on turn brown due to the sloughing off of tissues. Now the remote effects are merely shock due to its corrosive and CNS depressing effects. The patient is giddy with cold clammy skin. The weak pulse and thread, weak and thready pulse is observed. Contracted or pinpoint pupil is seen. There is strenuous breathing, phenolic smell, and it can be mistaken for opium poisoning or overdose, which has similar characteristics. Now, it also causes kidney damage and causes oliguria. There is albumin and metabolic products of carbolic acid metabolism, for example hydroquinines and pyrocatechols are seen in the urine. There is dark smoky green urine uh, to which comma and death follows. Now the fatal dose and fatal period. The fatal dose of carbolic acid is about 20 drops of pure phenol and probably twice that quantity of most carbolic acid disinfectants. And fatal period is about 3 to 4 hours, minimum recorded is 3 minutes and maximum 60 hours. Now in the case of treatment of acute carbolic acid poisoning, the degree of corrosion is not as severe as mineral acids, so a soft gastric tube is uh, passed and gastric lavage is done using glycerin in water. And then magnesium sulfate or liquid paraffin can be left in the stomach. Demulsants are used, IV saline plus sodium bicarbonate is also used to alkaline to make the alkaline to, to make the urine alkaline. Now in case of death, post-mortem appearance shows grayish white stains produced by the poison at the angles of the mouth. Odor is usually perceptible. The mucous membrane of the mouth or esophagus are swollen. Tongue is also swollen and white. The stomach looks leathery. And the liver spleen has white patches at which it is attached to the stomach. Glottis is swollen. Now in the case of the viscera to be sent to the chemical examiner, it should be preserved in saturated solution of sodium chloride and not rectified spirit. Now the medical legal aspects of uh, carbolic acid poisoning is that it is used as antiseptic, disinfectants and surface anesthetics. So some of these were used in the past to commit suicide but not now. They are uh, replaced by more advanced and um, better and less painful 
uh, materials. It is also sometimes used to procure abortion. Now another important point to make here is uh, carbolurea which is urinary findings of carbolic acid. In this case the patient's urine is clear in start but then becomes smoky due to the presence of hydroquinone and pyrocatechol which are the byproducts of carbolic acid. Another important point is ochronosis or phenol marasmus which is chronic exposure to phenol and it amounts to surgical surgeons or nurses uh, which use who use it as a disinfectant. That's all about carbolic acid.